Time is quickly running out for another coronavirus stimulus deal before the election. So this morning we're asking, do you think lawmakers can get it done? You can weigh in right now at 12news.com slash bullhorn. Well, on Sunday, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi said that she and Treasury Secretary Steve Mnuchin must reach an agreement within 48 hours, which means it needs to get done by the end of today. The major holdup, Democrats and Republicans have been way off on how much money they want to go to this new stimulus deal. Democrats have called for a relief bill with a price tag of $2.2 trillion. Some of the main things it includes are another round of stimulus checks, increased unemployment benefits, also more assistance for state and local governments. The White House has made a $1.8 trillion offer to Democrats. It includes many of the same things, but Speaker Pelosi says it lacks adequate funding for state and local governments as well as financial relief for American families. Not to mention the White House. The White House's deal also faces trouble from Republicans in the Senate. They are proposing a much more modest deal worth $500 billion, which would go to schools, hospitals, and small businesses. They plan to vote on that tomorrow. So with Speaker Pelosi's midnight deadline to get a deal done before the election, there are still major hurdles to get over. So do you think it will actually happen? Here's what some of you are saying this morning. Heather says, mm, not a chance. She's not feeling too optimistic this morning. And then Ashley says a single line item deal is not hard to pass. Do we have another one here from Janet? No, they're using it as a political thing and not interested in what the people who voted for them really want or need. Yeah, 76% of you this morning at this point are not feeling very optimistic. We've been asking, do you think lawmakers will reach a stimulus deal? If you haven't weighed in already, you can do so. 12news.com slash bullhorn or of course on our 12news app.